back to the channel. Smoke that is barbecue. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, it's cold out here. I just want y'all to see how sexy I was with that bald head, fresh. Ooh. But yeah, I'm finna um. You seen by the thumbnail, you know what I'm finna crank it up. I'm finna do some more of them neck bones. I'm finna do some smoke boneless neck bones in with the bone end. So yeah, we finna crank this thing up. So what I need y'all to do right now is go ahead and like this video before I even get started. Go ahead and like the video. That's right. Yeah, I see y'all liked my neck bones video and I went back and watched it. And I was like, I did a little quick video. So I was like, hey, I gotta run that video back so I can really show y'all how to do these things. But yeah, with that being said, y'all like this video. Take one second to like the video. Go ahead and comment you watching. You ready to see me do these smoke neck bones. I'm gonna run them back 2024. Yeah, I'm gonna bring some of these videos back. I'm going back and see these videos y'all liking and y'all watching. And I said, okay, I ain't make a long enough video. Let me make this video a little longer so I can show y'all how I really do this. Yeah, the sun cut me up, but uh, yeah, we finna uh, run to the store real quick. Early morning session, it's cold outside. Um, we finna get these neck bones. I'm finna show y'all how we uh, how I season them up, how I get my grill started. And we got them neck bones today, baby. Smoke neck bones, baby. I'm gonna be the neck bone man. Everybody doing oxtails and everything else. I guess I'm just be the king of the neck bones. I'm already king of the ribs. Uh, the lemon pepper ribs, I'm killing them with the lemon pepper stuff of ribs. I'm telling y'all, I ain't no game with them ribs. But y'all see everybody doing the oxtails, so I'm gonna probably stick to my pig feet and neck bones. I'm killing the oxtails I was doing. I've been doing them for like 10 years. I do oxtails in my sleep. But yeah, with that being said, if I run to the store, I'm gonna crank these neck bones up. You're gonna call me the neck bone king uh, this year. Let's get into this video. Oh yeah, let's get into it, let's get into it. These are boneless neck bones. Boneless neck bones right here. These some regular neck bones. I'm just going to throw these on at the same time and make everything do what it do. You're going to have to treat these boneless neck bones like, you're going to have to treat them like, almost like a Boston, but you know, you're going to have to let them low and slow and you got to make sure you get those nice and right. But we're going to start off, of course, this time I'm going to do a binder. Um, they be asking me about a binder, so I'm gonna do just a little mustard binder, you know, something light and easy. And that binder is gonna help give me a nice coating, a nice crust. So we're just gonna we're just gonna get these bindered in. Like I said, you would not taste the mustard, so don't worry about. Oh, he put mustard on. It's gonna taste like mustard. Cause trust me, I'm not a big mustard fan, but you do not taste this when you're cooking it. Trust me. I will not tell you anything wrong. Give me all the free game. Free, free, free game, free game. I said get that mustard on all of it. I said you're gonna have to treat these like a Boston bucket, they thick. Get them nicely. Get that mustard all over them, then we'll put some nice seasoning on them. Today's seasoning, I'm gonna keep it simple. I'm gonna do a uh, I'm going to show y'all the seasonings as well. We're going to keep it real simple. We're going to hit them with a little. I'm going to just do a little garlic powder. Hit them with a little onion powder. I'm going to hit them with some black pepper. Then I'm going to come behind it with a little of that. Smoked potpourri. Then you know we're going to eventually pull at the end. We'll glaze it with the. Uh, we'll glaze them with a little. A little bit of uh, parsley flakes for garnishment. So let's get into the seasoning process. Now let's go on with some seasoning. Hit it with a little garlic powder. And don't be scared to put it on there. Put a little garlic powder on there. Hit it with a little onion powder. Number flavor and seasoning, y'all. I'm finna show y'all how I do this. I'm talking about making real season to perfection. It's, hey, there's nothing to it but to do it. You can use as much seasoning you want. But like I said, if you think about it, if you put it on the grill, it's gonna, it's gonna take away a little bit, you know. But see the way I'm finna coat this on. I'm gonna make a nice crust. Look at that, ooh, look at that flavor. Look at that seasoning going down, baby. We finna take this down through the, ooh, wait. And like I said, you put as much seasoning you want. Now we're gonna take it and we're gonna just we're gonna mix it around, mix it around, mix it around, mix it around. I'm 
to get that music right real quick. Like I said, I'm gonna put my uh, other glove on. Like I said, just take it in now and mix it all up. Use whatever seasons you like. Like I said, this is just one of my, you know, easy seasoning. Ooh, look how they just coating out looking good. Ooh, ooh. Like I say, you know, I'm gonna go back and coat them again. This right here, just one little quick little mix in. Like I say, I don't use a uh, lighter fluid for my grill, so I got my chimney going. And uh, we're gonna get this party started. All right, one little last final coating. Give it one more last little quick coat. Are you ready for the smoking now? That's it right there, y'all. That's it right there. You ready for the smoke or not? Y'all can only smell the aroma. Ooh, come on through there one more time. One more time. One more time. One more time. Now, y'all got to look at these. Tell me that ain't looking good. Come on now. Tell me that ain't looking right. What a camera person that when you need them. Ain't got no camera person. They can really get in there on there for you. Ooh, ooh, look at that piece of meat. Look at that piece of meat, baby. You got it all the way around. Like I said, you're mixing around. Look, all over. All over. Boneless neck bones, baby. You see it. I'm the neck bone king. I can smoke it all. Oxtail, neck bones, pig feet. You name it, I'm doing it. So, yeah, let's get this uh, smoker ready. And we're gonna put these on the smoker, baby. Ooh, ooh, let's go. Okay, okay, okay. You see what I got going on? <clears throat> Get my chimney going. I use a chimney. Clean smoke. You know how I do it. So yeah, I use a chimney because I'm using my little barrel grill today. I'm gonna pull a big daddy back out. That's called Big Daddy. That's called Papa. Yeah, I'll tell y'all about Papa. I'm going to uh, refurbish Papa up and I'm going to start by using Papa for y'all. The reason why I call that Papa because I named it off my dad, Papa Joe. He was the real barbecue king. He taught me everything I know. Not everything, but he got me where I started. And before he died, he told me, he said, hey, he passed the torch to me. He said, I got it. So I used to, I do all the, the family functions and stuff, so. That's why they call me Smoke Daddy Barbecue, the best thing smoking. So, yeah, I got the meat marinating for about 30 minutes to an hour. Like I said, I'm going to get my fire started. We're going to put it on the barrel grill. And we're going to show you how we keep it real, baby. Smoke Daddy Barbecue, best thing smoking. Let's get into it. Okay, got the grill nice and hot. Like I say, Offset, I got my fire and some wood on this side. And I'm gonna put the neck bones on this side and let them smoke. That's the name of the game, offset cook. I'm showing you how to do this on a barrel grill. So everybody don't know how to use wood. Everybody don't have a special grill. So I'm just gonna show you an old fashioned barrel grill that I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all own one of these. If not, it's a great investment. Just gotta keep them covered cause they will, they'll go out. All right, so let's get this thing going. Oh yeah. So we're gonna put these big ones right here. We're gonna put these closer to the fire. Cause these are gonna take the longest to cook. Yeah, I got everything make sure I get it. Yeah, that's the wood over there burning. This is wood burning, so this is gonna keep it hot. I'm using pecan wood again. These little ones, they'll probably cook so fast. I'm putting them towards the outside end. Let's see. There we go. Get that camera right. The cameraman, the cook, and everything all in one, y'all.
piece of meat and it'll cook just like that. So there y'all go. We're going to let these smoke for about, I'm going to say they're going to probably go for about six hours. Right here, the thickest pieces of meat, they're going to take the longest. So, like I said, I got the fire over here. We're going to let the fire. We got the fire over here. Wood and charcoal. reason why I'm doing wood and charcoal because a lot of folks don't know how to just cook with wood. So, I have to show you how to cook with charcoal. A lot of folks, I'm teaching how to do charcoals, and it's, it's a lot easier for people. That wood, it'll catch flame, it'll catch fire, and people probably burn their meat up. So I don't want to show them that, because I will sear my meat up over here. I'm going to take it and sear it as well, but what I like to do is start off, just get a nice, slow and slow and smoke. Let's get into it, y'all. Stay tuned. Mm, 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 mm. Tell me that ain't looking good. We just getting started. I'm gonna work that camera for y'all. I'm gonna work that camera for y'all. Y'all stay tuned. Let's go ahead and check these things out. I got it running at 250 as you can see. Clean smoke. Clean smoke. You barely can even see smoke coming out of it. Clean smoke, baby. I got y'all. I'm gonna show you how we do this. Let's check these neck bones out. Let's get up in there for y'all. Let's get in there one time. Come on now. Let's get in there. You see the juice on it, baby? Yeah, boy. <laughs> hey, I told y'all. It's finna go down. Mmm, 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 mmm. You see it, y'all. That's on the hour in. Hour in. Make sure you spray that meat. I'm, gonna, I'm just getting y'all some good footage of it. Then I'm going to spray my meat. You know, we're going to continue letting it smoke. Oh, they're coming out so good. Look how juicy it is. Can y'all see the juice on it? Mm, 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 mm. Zoom it out. Zoom it in. Oh, season. Look how that season stick on there, baby. I ain't playing no games with it. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Let's get in there for y'all real close. Ooh. Wee. I ain't playing now. Boneless neck bone. And these got the bone in. I'm going to spray it up. Add me another piece of wood to it. And we're going to keep on smoking. I said it's only an hour in. I'm going to add me some sausage to it. I'm going to put me some red links on. Eat that for me a little appetizer. So you'll see me add the red links in a minute. Spray your meat now. Make sure you spray that meat. I'm gonna spray mine. Spray that meat. Put it on there. Don't be scared to spray it, baby. And then we keep it juicy. That, that season's still sticking to it, baby. Like something to add these red links to it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I like them good and wet, baby. I'm gonna add these red links to it and we're gonna make it do what it do. Tell me that ain't looking good. You see that smoke, baby. I got another piece of that pecan wood. Got that pecan wood running in there. Ooh, wee, that looking good. So I'm gonna add these, uh, some, some red links on there. Add a couple red links and we're gonna make it do what it do today, y'all. It's a nice, pretty day. It's starting to warm up some. Started out real cold, but it's warming up very well. Put these red links on and keep it going. They look like some hot dog, but them are some red link sausages. I love red link sausages. What y'all know about them red link? Them hot red link sausages. If you like them, comment down below if you like the red link hot link sausage. They so good. Had to throw a couple of those on there. I got these on the hot side. I'm gonna let them grill. Like they gonna kind of grill and smoke at the same time while they just sit back and slow roll. You seen how I spritzed them? I spritzed them down real good. Like I said, we're gonna close the grill down and let it finish cooking. Tell me that ain't looking good, y'all. Come on now. Come on and get you a sample. Hopefully I got some out of the sample on camera. That's my goal to get at least two people to sample on camera. 
Um, if not, you know, I'm going to try to record them because they don't want to be on camera, but hopefully they'll be on camera for me. The neck bones. Boneless neck bones. Let's get it going on, baby. That's right. Stay tuned. Okay, okay. Got them hot links about ready. They almost ready. Hey, if you ain't got no burn on them hot links, I don't want it. Something about a hot dog and a sausage off the grill, you got to put a little burn mark on it. That smoke coming through, y'all. I'm trying to get enough for y'all. That smoke ain't playing. Ooh. Let me get enough. Yeah, so next time y'all see these pretty boys. That's why I had to show y'all because these about to come up. Then I'm just finish letting these smoke. Yeah, boy. Not show y'all the red link though. Got that burn on it. Ooh, I'm gonna put a piece of uh, light bread on it. Y'all don't hear me. Piece of light bread. I ain't, I'm not finna put no hot dog, but I'm finna get a light bread. That's right, some white bread. Ooh, look at them sausages. Look at them red link sausages with that burn on it. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all see it live and direct. Mm, mm. Let's get in there. Then them boneless. Tell me that ain't coming out right. Ooh, them the ones with the bone in. Oh yeah. Ooh, now I'm three hours in. Now at this stage and point, a lot of people like to take them and wrap them and foil them and just make them tender that way. You definitely can do that. There's nothing wrong with that. That way you know it's guaranteed tender. You got all the smoke in you want on there. You got all the flavor. But me personally, I like to grill my meat till it's nice and tender. You still can see the juice on my meat. You still can see that juice. And that's why I say heavy spritz it. You got the heavy spritz it. Keep it nice and moist. So what I'm about to do now is I'm going to finish cooking them on the grill. At this stage, three hours in, you can take them, wrap them, foil them, or whatever you want to do. You can make them nice and tender within the next hour. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let them smoke. I'm going to take these and I'm going to probably flip them and sear them. Spritz them up real heavy and see what we're looking like then. Without wrapping and foiling, I still got about probably two hours on these. Well, I said these are going to be cooking like more like a Boston, but as you can see, these these about ready. These little small ones, they about ready. I'm going to heavy spritz them again. I'm going to add a little bit more piece of wood to my smoke side. And we're going to make it do what it do. And I'm going to show y'all how tender they come out. Like I said, hopefully I get somebody to review it on camera for y'all. So y'all can see the... I don't just be playing when I say it's seasoned and cooked to perfection. Mm, 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 mm. That looks good. Alright, this way it gets intense there. I'm finna, I got them on the sear side. I'm going to sear them up real quick. Sear them up, lock it in, and we're gonna put them back on the smoke side. I'm showing y'all the secret. Showing y'all the secret. Sear them up a little bit and put them back on the smoke side. Alright, I moved these two over. I'm trying to show y'all. I'm trying to work the camera and show y'all how to sear side, make it get a little a little crust on it. I gotta move the other two over so y'all stay tuned. Like so I'm searing them up, y'all. Put that crust on it, lock it in some more. And we're gonna let them finish smoking. Alright, I'm trying to I'm trying to multitask, but I got it pretty good. That's the sear side. I said just put a little extra color on it. That's all I did. I just seared up for an extra color. Lock the flavors in. I just move it back to the cold side and let it finish smoking. As you see, everything's still on the grill. I'm not gonna wrap it. I'm not gonna put it in no kind of boil, foil, brine, braise, nothing. 
I'm going to show you how I smoke my meat and make it nice and tender. You got to heavy spread. I'm going to heavy spread. I'm going to my spread. You got to come in with that spray. I'm going to put so much spray on it. It's like it's boiling and braising at the same time. That's how much spray I put on it. Because you can see how much. Look at the juice still sitting on the. You see how the juice still sit on the on the meat? I heavy I heavy spray it. And it's like I guess this is like my braids. So what I got in this bottle is something killer. It's gonna make a tender every time. So look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at that. Come on now. Come on now. Them neck bones ain't playing. Look at them neck bones. Ooh, ooh, neck bone here. Add me another piece of wood to it. We're gonna make it do what it do. The last hour, I should be able to pull them and show y'all how tender they are. They are ready. To... Ooh, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Finishing product. I don't smoke them till they can't take no smoke no more. They are seized. They tender. They falling apart. I don't know what else to tell y'all. Gonna let my neighbor them taste them. We're gonna see if I can get a little reaction, a little review. He don't wanna be on the camera. I'm gonna see if I can turn the camera my way. At least let y'all hear him tell y'all how tender this food is. I got to get somebody to tell you how tender this is. Finishing product. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. What can I say? Smoke daddy barbecue. The best thing smoking. Let me see if I can get them to go taste it for y'all. That looks so delicious. Look at all that juice still on there. I'm going to spray it again. Let me see if I can show y'all a little tender. Let me see. What y'all want to see? Can we do one? Let me see what it's doing. Uh oh. Uh oh, tender, 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 tender. Oh, snap. I ain't gonna show out too bad. Hold on, what about them? What the big one doing? Oh, yeah. Let's pull them up. Let's see what we got. Yeah, I don't be smelling no smoke. Hey, I, I know you do smell it. I'm smelling now. We got new boxes. Nah, I don't worry about the box. Oh, just, 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 just go in now. Don't worry about the box. Nah. What I got here is, is boneless neck bones, and that's the bone in. So just, I know you don't like being on camera, so I got it facing me. Uh -huh. I would love to let you get one <laughs> bite, but I, they, they so scared to be on camera. I just, I just got to at least let them hear. I got to at least let them hear you. All right, all right. The smoke that is uh, boneless neck bone. Okay. I'm going to try it out. All right, you hear him now. I ain't got him on no camera. Season real good. Okay. Nice and tender. Okay. Okay, y'all hear it now. Mm -hmm. He don't want to be on camera, but hey, hey, I, I got him. I got him this time. At least, at least y'all can hear somebody. Y'all yeah, be, y'all think I be playing? I got, I got him tasting it, y'all. I'm gonna, hold on, let me get him just to show a little bit of food. There you go. So that's the uh, boneless. That's one with no season. That one got uh, barbecue sauce on it. So you gotta try one with the barbecue sauce. It's a, a light barbecue sauce. I kind of like glazed it. Let's see what he say. It's like a peach bourbon barbecue sauce. I could have put a little bit more, but mm -hmm. I just put a little light on it. You can take just a little bit, but it's okay. still good and tender. Okay, you hit y'all hear this now. It's, it's, it's going live and direct. And now that's the one with the bone in. Mm -hmm. so if, tell, me, tell me what we're working with now. Hey, I had to get him, y'all. He didn't want to be on camera, but I Sweet got him. Y'all hear it live and direct. That ain't me in the background. Ooh, ooh. Mmm. Y'all better come get yourself some. <laughs> Y'all heard it. He said, come get y'all some. <laughs> Stop playing. Y'all think I be playing with this food, y'all. I'm telling y'all. I'm I'm for real with good it. Good smoke flavor, good smoke ring. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Let me get that smoke ring on there. Oh, man. Y'all see that smoke ring? Oh, come on. I ain't got to say no more, y'all. I appreciate you uh, actually letting me get a review uh, live and direct this time. I appreciate <laughs> you. I, I, I didn't get to show them, but y'all hear this person in the background. Y'all seen somebody else's hand on that meat. It's not me. I try to tell y'all I do this, man. 
So y'all just know, y'all need some no smoke neck bones. Follow the recipe. You seen the recipe? I showed y'all everything. Over here in Alice in the steak, baby. <laughs> you heard it live in direct Columbus, Georgia, baby. We down here in the south making the do what to do. We smoking the barbecue too now. We ain't in the neighborhood. We in Alice in the steak. Baby. Hey, you heard it now. <laughs> Come on now. That's that real smoke. That the best thing smoking, man. I appreciate that. Because hey, they be thinking I be playing. They be like, you don't want in your meat. You gonna always say it good. <laughs> Uh oh, what Chris said. Oh, I got Chris. Oh, let me see if I get my other neighbor. Y'all stay tuned. All right, we got another one, y'all. Going in for the. That's the one with no sea, uh, no sauce, and that's one with sauce, and that's just the. That's boneless, and that's bone in, neck bone. <laughs> what you think? Yeah. Y'all see it now. Y'all always talk about y'all want to see somebody else taste my food. That's that peach bourbon sauce. Nice sauce. Okay. Mm. What you nice. think about it? Tender? Mm -hmm. Tough? Tender. tender? Okay. Mm -hmm. Got some flavor on it? Mm -hmm. Okay. He going in with the one with the bone, y'all. Y'all got to watch this now. Mm, that good smoke ring, too. Oh, see that smoke ring. Y'all hear him now. Uh-oh. Mm. Uh-oh. Yeah, this is the one right here. Uh-oh. <laughs> Live and direct, man. Bone him. Okay. Yeah. That's it right there? Yeah. Look at that, y'all. Uh, smoke ring. Look at all that flavor. Mm -hmm. Y'all thought it was a game. I'm telling y'all, I'm going to get somebody to taste my food. They, they think I be playing. They say, you the only person tasting your food, so how can we believe it's really true? Well, I ain't tasting nothing he made that wasn't good. Yeah. Okay, y'all heard that now. <laughs> Everything he had so far been good. So, hey, they, I really appreciate you. Uh, yeah, let me put you on camera showing how you... How them neck bones going down through. Y'all look at that, y'all. Y'all see that? Coming out that bone. Smoke ring, baby. Yeah. You see it live and direct, baby. Tender. That's that. That's boneless po That's boneless neck bones. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Y'all seen it here. Live and direct. Talk to him. Talk to him. Huh? Appreciate you, my man. Ooh, look at him. I seen all the smoke. So you seen the smoke. <laughs> yeah, he, hey, the other person's claim he ain't seen no smoke, ain't smell. See, he always give me a hard time, and he don't want to be on the camera. The main one I want to be on camera give you the most hardest time ever. But like I said, I so appreciate it, man. I look over here, I be like, oh, he back there cooking. See, hey, y'all see it live in that rate. This somebody, this one of my good neighbors. They ain't scared to get on camera, and like I say, he took that, he took them neck bones down through there. I really appreciate it. Y'all stay 